Well, let me describe uh, for a few minutes uh, the, the idea I had and the, the general theory that I've advanced. Um, the, the, the influence strategy decision uh, system I have is uh, an ontology, I think it's probably referred to as an ontology of what we what we'd regard as or argue are irreducibly unique stratagems. We believe of influence. We've, there's been some discussion of whether or not those are uh, stratagems of persuasion or of communication or of something else, but our, our current view is that these are elements of influence. Um, there are 24 uh, in the system that are arranged uh, under uh, a very modest strata of, of subclasses, of seven subclasses and three classes, ranging roughly from assessment to uh, conditioning to engagement. So in other words, if you, as you move left to right on what you might think of this, of, of this as a periodic table of influence, to use that metaphor, you move from very low engagement mode to a fairly high engagement mode. We believe that that uh, responsibly and exhaustively uh, covers the range and explains, uh, to use business parlance, the, the games or the gamesmanship or the moves and the counter moves that occur in not only in communications, uh, which we study here of course, um, but in a variety of uh, what I call influence industries, whether it is marketing, public relations, advertising, lobbying, even, me even military information uh, warfare. Um, so that is the, uh, the essential uh, structure uh, of, of the system. You can tell that it is, it, it, the centerpiece of it is the standard table of, of influence strategies. And there's a variety of other subsystems that have to do with variables uh, and the way in which uh, uh, plays, if you'll accept my terminology, as shorthand for influence strategies uh, are used as, as, a, as, a, as a method of practice uh, between parties and publics. Alan, uh, can the, can, can the uh, playmaker influence decision system be used to either analyze or and or to plan strategies that are, as Professor, Professor Grunig say, it says symmetrical and collaborative, or is it by, by definition uh, asymmetrical and pers persuasion oriented? Well, the system is first and foremost descriptive. Uh, that, that my first job, I felt, was, um, uh, was to try to, uh, in some sort of uh, work of social archaeology, to try to un and disencrust and dust off what, what I felt might be uh, you know, the, the, the properly described um, stratagems we use to, to bend our will, whether or not it is in, uh, in a cooperative sense or whether or not it is in a directly competitive sense. I didn't so much care about that as, what, as that I wanted to try to capture the full um, a full or exhaustive set of those things and to be able to argue that each one of those, in this case we now think there are 24, are irreducibly unique. So uh, when Jim invited me a few years back uh, to lecture to one of his uh, graduate classes, he indeed, he leaned over my shoulder, he says, where are the collaborative plays? Mm -hmm. And the question, you know, was stunning, you know, because it's coming from Jim and I did have the sense that the, the first iteration of the system I developed was somewhat bilateral and, and not fundamentally uh, uh, collegial, cooperative, uh, collaborative. And so we went back at least within, contained within you know, my world and my theory, uh, I then um, went about adding uh, a full module that allows you, as you go through this decision system, which is what it is, uh, not only to consult its benefits and its deficits of each play, or how to counter it, but in fact how to help it. So if, so if an influence strategy is empo employed by you toward Jim, and I like that, then I would be able to uh, uh, consult the system to understand then how I can use employ in influence strategies to help you uh, in your strategy toward Jim, not just simply in to help you compete against right. Jim. So what you're saying is it's both descriptive and predictive to, to a degree. You can use it to, 
to be predictive. Yes. Yeah. Prediction is very uh, dangerous, of course, and people generally prefer to talk about anticipation. But I do think, uh, but the, yes, the system is designed fundamentally to, to recognize uh, a strategy that is at play, whether or not it's by you, for you, with you, or against you, um, but then also to figure out what to do about it. How would you then handle it? How would you reconcile it? Um, and to what end? Mm -hmm.